Welcome to MobileSyrup.com, mobile news and reviews for Canadians. This is the iPhone 3GS. We're going to take a quick gander into this. I've been really playing with this over the last few days since it came out on the 19th. And you can see the overall design has not changed. You still have the 3.5 touch screen, home button right there, left hand side, you got your volume rocker plus your ringer on off. On the top you have a 3.5mm earphone jack with your power on off, also to save the battery life there as well. In addition, you got your earpiece there, right hand side nothing. The bottom you got your speakers plus a place to charge this puppy up. The back you have your 3 megapixel camera. The new addition is that you can take video with this. Also, if we just crack this right open, you can see that it really does look the same. Now, some key features that we're going to do in this review, we're not going to go over the whole entire iPhone because we're just going to go over the new additions to the 3.0. Mainly, we're going to start right off with the camera. This can take video, but one of the key things about this is that you can certainly go straight into your previous pictures, go right into your camera roll, and go straight into your video. So we did take a short video. So you can see that right now, on the top here, you can see that there are some areas where I can go in and simply edit this video, which is a really nice feature to have. All you have to do is simply scroll through this video cut the areas where you don't want to have them anymore and then essentially trim it which is what the trim button is on top here. Now once you do trim it you can't go back to the previous video you have to simply just go forward with what the trim section is. So I'm just going to go ahead and trim it you can see it's trimming on the bottom now if, if I press play it's a shorter video so you can see that's what the whole video editing is all about. A really cool feature to this edition of this uh, new iPhone. In addition, we're going to go to the camera roll. You can see there's a bunch of pictures here. Same thing with the previous models. You can simply just simply scroll through everything that you do want. All your pictures accordingly. Really easy to do so. Simple to use. It's what the iPhone, one of the things that iPhone is really made for. So let's say you do not want some of the pictures. All you'd have to do is simply go into your camera roll, press on the left hand button down there, it gives you some options. You can share it, copy it, or delete. If you don't want some of these pictures, all you have to do is simply select them and then press delete. And it gives you the option to delete the selected items and therefore it's gone. Let's say you do want to share some of these. You can simply click on an item, hit this forward button here, you can easily easily share it by email, MMS, add to your contact, use as a wallpaper. So just simply easy to do and get things done by this way. Another cool feature on this new iPhone is the compass. You can see it shows us our location. If we switch it around it just simply changes the area that we're pointing. So in case you're ever lost, all you'll have to do is press on the left hand button down there. It takes you straight into Google Maps where you can simply find your way and find a location. So if you want to go to a specific location, let's just say 100 Front Street, let's go there and it'll get directions for you. Easy as that. Just simply easy to find your way home in case you're lost. Other than this, we can go straight into another cool feature that is a new addition to this, is the voice memo. You can see it looks like a microphone, and if we want to remember something or tell us something later, all you have to do is press the record button, and it simply starts recording whatever you do want to have. You can see on the top here it says recording with a number of seconds going, or eventually minutes as well. If you do want to stop, simply press the stop button on the right hand side and it'll stop. But if you do want to go back and play your voice memos, just hit this, hit this button and you can see it shows a list of things that you do have. So 
So you can see you can have options to share this as well, either email the voice memo or MMS as well. Another cool feature to get your things done here. One of the other great things about this is the YouTube application. Just simply, it's just a lot faster. I'm going to show you how quick and easy it is here. You can see it loads it up. But what's different from this one compared to the previous models is that the images load a lot faster. You can see you can scroll through them. You can see it just loads faster. Volume's decent as well. So there we go, it just has low battery. Just gonna dismiss it. So that's enough of that. And in addition, one of the majority of key features of this is simply how fast everything is. So if we just go into a new browser, I'll just go and go to mobilesyrup.com. You can see how fast the pages do load up. And what I'm going to do is just go into a story. I'm going to do cut and paste, cut, copy, and paste. Another cool feature that they've had in addition in this. All you have to do is simply go over an area, hold it down for a few seconds, and you can see it can copy this area that you do want. So I'm just going to go ahead and copy it. It's going to get out of here. Go into my notes section to make it easier. I'm going to add a note. If I hold down, it'll give me the option, once I let go, to paste it in there. You can see that this is what I did copy in there. But what's even greater about this is that you can cut, copy, and paste. So let's say I just hold it down, let go of it. It gives you options to select, select all, or paste again. So I'm just going to select an area. You can see if I scroll over it, it will give me a little bit of a more freedom to choose the area that I do want. So what I'm going to do is cut it from this area. I'm going to paste it right at the bottom there. So all you have to do is tap on it and it will paste right there. Just incredibly easy to do here. There you are. So just cut, copy and paste. New to the iPhone, really easy to get things done here. I'm just going to throw that right in the trash. So this is some of the new features of the iPhone. Really easy to get things done, really fun to do. Another new addition, once you swipe to the left, or you can see that if we just go back to the home screen, if you tap on the home screen again, it takes you right into the searching aspect. So you begin to search, and it brings up everything in the iPhone that you've had stored in there. So let's say I'm looking for something that begins with a B, it brings up everything in there. If I want to go back, for example, I want to search something with A, bring up Angelina Jolie, brings up all her contact information accordingly. Just another cool feature to get to the areas that you want faster on your iPhone. So this is currently available at Rogers and Fido, also available at the Apple stores. This has been one of several reviews that we're going to do of the iPhone 3GS. We'll have more information on this on mobilesyrup.com.